I wanted somewhere that he could be included and um, where he could just excel and be happy. Incredibly proud. <laughs> very, very proud of him. <laughs> this is a football training session with a difference. We've got kids with Down syndrome, cerebral palsy, ADHD, autism. Hi, my name's Sean and I'm the disability activator for Cobble Town Football Club. Within these sessions, the, the kids and the parents feel comfortable. Football is for everybody. Everybody should be allowed to play football. Sean helped set up the inclusive coaching sessions after his autistic son struggled at a mainstream football camp. My son Alfie, he's uh, 11 years old and because of his uh, special needs he struggled at the camp but instead of them trying to uh, you know, work through it, we got a phone call so we had to go and collect Alfie sort of the first day into a two day camp. You feel that you know, these parents are going to struggle to be able to take their children to a club for fear of failure. So that's when we decided that, that, that Colville we were going to set up an inclusive uh, football session. Sessions down here are very light-hearted, we have a bit of fun. If some of the children need a bit of one-to-one, -one, then we'll give one-to-one -one support. Um, I like it because um, you've got like different stations and there's loads of different fun activities to try and do. If we win the matches, I like going to I like, so yeah. <laughs> yeah. Parents believe the weekly sessions are also having a positive impact on their children off the pitch. So Alfie um, was diagnosed with autism before he started school. He just seems more confident. I think being around other children and having the ability to socialise with other children um, has just built his confidence in all areas actually, in his education and at home. A couple of weeks ago she'd had a really tough day at school. She wasn't communicating whatsoever. She came to the session, she started to communicate again, she was interacting and it had just taken that horrendous experience in a school that she'd had and gave her that fun back, that excitement, and she was a completely different child once we left again. A good friend of mine, Anthony Moore, got me down to this club and sadly he passed away about 18 months ago. He brought a lot of these kids through, so for me to carry on this, you know, this legacy and to bring something else to the club is absolutely amazing. Who's had lots of fun? Yeah. This is probably one of the most rewarding things that I've ever done in football. See you all next week, yeah? Well done. Fantastic.